We got some hide. We got some pelt. Hide and pelt. That's what I like to see. Oh, no. Not again. Not again. Not again. Not again. No. <laughs> hey, everybody. Mr. Mioli here. And welcome, 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 welcome to episode one of our Aberration DLC gameplay. I am so excited to be starting this. We are... Well, we're playing the Aberration DLC that dropped a couple days ago. I did stream a bunch of that uh, on release, so if you missed that video, go ahead and check that out. But this is a completely new world. We're playing on a server. I think Pete, Pizza Hut's on here. Lachlan's playing on here. Wizzy is coming on here. Wizzle, I haven't met him yet. I'm going to have, have, to, have to have a chat with him at some stage and potentially some other guys as well. Um, it's been a while since we've played on a server, so it's going to be interesting finally having some other people around us as we go about our survival in the world of Aberration on this brand new, brand spanking new arc right here. Now, um... Well, yeah, I guess this episode, we're just going to jump in, we're going to explore, we're going to suss out some of the new things, and uh, really just get a feel for the world. I think I've uh, gotten a couple levels here, sitting here already, because I've been sitting here for a little while. Um, we've got all of our skins, let's go and, uh, let's go and, let's go and ditch all of them. I might, oh yeah, we're going to keep a couple of them. There's a couple that we just always use every season. I'm going to keep the Santa hat. It's Christmas time! We gotta use that one there. Um, and we got four levels to designate. Let's go throw these ones onto health, melee damage, melee damage, and weight. There we go. There's our four levels. Uh, now we do have a couple mods installed. They're more just like simple mods. We got the S plus mod just for building to help with help with building. We've got the upgrade station just so we can upgrade our tools. We've got resource stacks so that we can stack up more items. And I think that might be it. And po that's possibly it. I feel like there's a fourth one that I'm forgetting. But guys, I'm super duper excited about this. If you guys do enjoy this video, if you guys are pumped for Aberration and this series, then make sure to go ahead. You gotta help me kick this series off with a big, oh, punch of the thumbs up. Make it rain those thumbs ups. Let's get into this thing. For those of you who are uh, tuned into that stream or have seen other people have been playing, um, there is something about this world, or this spawn point right here, that is a recommended spawn point that we, uh, we know, but a lot of people don't know. And that is that there is no water nearby, and if you're not careful, you're gonna, you're gonna, you're gonna die of thirst out here. So, um, we're gonna make our way to water as quick as possible. And we've just found our very first explorer note! Mainlin! Cool. Don't mind if I do. Don't mind if I do. Very cool. I like that. Awesome. All right. So, uh, yeah, we got to get to water as quick as possible. Um, and we got to get set up as quick as possible. Um, yeah, that's, that's, <laughs> that's about it. Let's actually throw this level down. Seven. So I turned the experience rates. They're up a little bit, but they're also not that OP. So this is interesting that we've gained seven levels just now. Um, a lot of these things will be adjusted as we play through. Just, just to keep it all, you know under control and under wraps and whatnot uh let's get started though let's let's head on down let's come on down and get ourselves some tools going because uh i mean that's that's step one of arc after all we got to get ourselves some pickaxe we got to get ourselves a hatchet some campfires some food and all the rest of it uh, we do need to be careful though because there are a lot of raptors that spawn in fact i can see one i can see one right there i'm gonna avoid him i ain't ready for no raptors just yet um let's just get so hey buddy Hey buddy, Mr. Aberrant Parasaur. By the way, for those of you who are unfamiliar what, with uh, what the Aberration mo uh, DLC world comes with, it's kind of like we get a bunch of variations of dinosaurs. Like we're in an alien world that's kind of been, it's kind of been a little bit busted up a little bit. You know what I mean? It's a little bit weird and funky. Um, and part of that, part of that is the fact that these, um, well... I guess the dinosaurs have been contaminated a little bit. There's also these little mushrooms here that give us a couple of little variations of mushrooms and they can be used to tame a thing or two. They're quite handy and quite cool as well. Uh, but basically, the world's been contaminated. We've got these weird variants of just the default standard dinosaurs of the real world or the Ark Islands. I don't even know if that's a real world to be honest. I don't really know much, but um... Yeah, so things are a little different basically. Things are a little different, the dinosaurs are different, the world is different. And I really, I'm a little bit scared and stuff. I don't want to really feel like dying. There is a dead raptor down here, though. And he's got some arrow. Okay, okay, okay. Don't mind if I do. I'll get myself a little bit of a hat. We'll get ourselves a... I may as well take a spear from him and... Oh. 
I was gonna say I should get some should get some tools should get myself like a, a, a pickaxe or something But a little bit of height is definitely gonna kickstart our Kickstart our adventure. That's for sure. Um, okay. I need some stone Are there any stones on the ground? There we go. Okay, that's all I needed. So we should be good to craft ourselves a stone pick on the way. That's what I like to see. And now that we've done that, oh, the sky is the limit, baby. The sky is the limit. So, uh, what am I looking for here? I need myself a hatchet, a campfire. In fact, I get myself the S plus campfire. All right, and we should be good right there. Our thirst is dropping very quickly. I don't know if you guys can see that, but um, it's disappearing quite fast. So we're gonna be careful. Oh. I just realized the fungal trees give you mushrooms. Mushrooms, thatch, and wood. That's interesting. All right. We'll get ourselves some flint. Let's get ourselves a hatchet now. And what am I missing? We need we need two more stone to get ourselves... To get ourselves a campfire. It's weird the resources that this thing's given away, by the way. It's kind of like... Taken a lot of hits and has given us very bulk amounts of stuff. I don't know if that's part of the server settings or what, but I might need to take a little peek into that. All right, let's get ourselves a campfire. Um, S plus one, preferably. All right, at least we can go get ourselves some food. And oh my gosh, there it is. We've gained a level, but hey, buddy, I think you're stuck in the ground down there. Can you get out of there or not? Anyways, these are the new guys. These guys are called Bob Dogs. And these are like the little pets of the Aberration arc. You've had Dodos, you've had Jerboas, and I guess these guys are like the, the next level. Now, I believe one of these mushrooms is used to feed them, but I can't remember which one it is. Get a feeling it might be this one. Do you want to eat some aquatic mushrooms, buddy? Oh, I think she does. I think she does. These guys are awesome. These guys are so cool. And because the world, as you can probably tell, is very dark and gloomy. Well, these guys have little light bulbs on them. And, um, they can light the world up as they go. Ooh, funky music. <laughs> oh, I like the music that they've uh, created for this DLC, by the way. Anyways, two down, one to go. We're going to have our very own female bulb dog, who's going to be our companion on our journey. It's very low level. It's only level 10, but it's gonna have to do, I suppose. Gonna have to do. And I'm gonna need a name for him. She's gonna need a name. She's definitely gonna need a name. And this is where I'm gonna turn to you guys. You guys gotta tell me this. What are we gonna call our very first little cutie bomb dog right here? Let me know down below in the comments. I'm leaving it in your hands. It better be a good one. We need a good name. We need a good name for our number one team this season. Um, yeah. And what's awesome about this guy is, check this out, ready? You ready for this? You ready for this? We can pat him. <laughs> and it makes this little light on his head spark up, I suppose, and it can like lead us. But we'll turn that off because he can only, do I pet him? There we go. We'll turn the light off because he's got a charge and we don't want that to run out. All right, let's plop him up on our shoulder. Look at him right there. Oh, he's a little gorgeous thing. He's a little gorgeous thing. Um, all right, let us continue. Let, let us continue. Let us continue. I made myself a campfire, didn't I? Yes, we did. And our thirst is increasing at an alarming rate. A very, very fast rate. So we've got to be careful there. We've got to make sure we stay on top of that. Um, we do not want to die of thirst. We do not. We do not. We do not want to die of thirst. Um, I think I can head down here over in this direction. I think this is how we get to like the main area of the world. I hope. I think. Or up there, maybe. I can't remember. When we streamed it, I kind of just gave up and spawned myself in somewhere else. Um, and I don't really want to do that this time. I kind of want to do it as well as possible the first time around. But I think what we're going to do... Wait. Oh, snap! Oh, yes! This is one of the awesome new inclusions in the game. This here is... This here is an earthquake. This here is an earthquake. And little items can pop out of the ground as you're like roaming around in an earthquake. I don't know if you can die to one. I think it's more just a pain in the backside. So as you can see, we got like flint, we got wood, we got stone. We got some obsidian already. A lot of stuff popping out of the ground here. Um, so it's like free re- Oh no, I'm thirsty already. What did I do to deserve this? Why can't some water pop out of the ground? And that's a gas vein. I don't know what you can do with gas veins. But I don't think it's going to help our thirst. And uh, the odd thing is, these aquatic mushrooms. You would assume an aquatic mushroom would help with 
Thirst? Well, it doesn't. I swear I just heard something weird. It's all good. Alright, let's keep on making our way through here. We gotta get to water. That's like priority number one right now. And I guess I also gotta get this this camp. Oh, now I can place a campfire. All right, we'll pick some stuff, uh, some stuff up as we go. All right, this area right here looks really cool. All right, let's throw it down right here. Campfire. Get yourself down there. Let's throw some meat in. Uh, let's throw some wood in, and we'll light that up. So I'm pretty sure that actually, do I have to craft this stuff myself? No, nope, it's gone itself. Okay, I'm pretty sure that meat also quenches your thirst a little bit. Which is why I'm gonna get this. If it doesn't do anything for our, our thirst, I'm just gonna go. I'm just gonna go. We'll find our own way. We'll find our own way. Don't you worry. The question is though, does it? I'm gonna put this in slot five. Does that help my thirst at all? I don't think it did. It's helping my th my hunger. Definitely not my thirst. Thirst. All right, we gotta keep going. We gotta keep on moving. Grab everything. Grab the campfire. Pick it up. Nope, not like that. Pick it up. And let's continue. So there should be water just a little bit further ahead. I hope we make it. Yes. Oh, snap. Okay. Yeah, there's definitely water down there. I just don't know how safe the water is. Because there's a giant freaking jumping crab down there. I haven't, I haven't come across one of those yet. I haven't experienced one of them yet. I don't know if... I don't know how that's going to go for us if we do. I think I've got to... Oh, no. We can run around this way. Okay. We might have some hope. There might be some hope in store for us. We just gotta, I suppose, run all the way around here to the water. Um, but if you guys are wondering how this season's gonna work, I, we're gonna, we're gonna have, we're gonna have some, um, some collabs. We're gonna collab with Lachlan and the other guys, hopefully. Um, uh, we were gonna do episode one together, but he's in the middle of something with his computer. Okay, we're good. We're good. He's in the middle of some stuff. So I said, we'll do episode one separately and then we'll meet up again and continue from there type of thing so um hashtag thanks Lachlan I feel like that's like the new thanks Obama thanks Lachlan appreciate it buddy <laughs> but um let's keep going let's keep going so you will see Lachlan appearing on the channel in this series it's gonna be a lot of fun um that's probably something I've missed in like my, my recent arc series it's all been solo so we haven't had the ability of playing with people and running into people and seeing like what they're doing around the world uh, which I'm really excited to see this season. I'm really excited to see how everybody else plays and progresses and crossing paths with them and yeah, everybody's got a very individual play style. Okay, that stego kind of scared me for a second there. I think we've finally reached water. We're so close. Except there's a giant crab and some... Okay, there's a couple down there. Giant crabs, there's spinos, there's all sorts down here. I might just creep into this little... This little nook right here and grab myself a sip of water, though. There we go. There we go. We live to tell the tale, baby. We live to tell the tale! What's that over there? No, brothers! No! No, 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 no! Not like this! I'm gonna try and kill him. Lucky. I was gonna try and swim over there, because it looks like there's something there. I don't know what it is. There's metal over there. Maybe that's where we can build our very first house. Problem is... Problem is, one tiny, itty bitty little problem. Seriously, where did that piranha go? Oh, come on now. No, 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 no. I'd rather know where he is than not know, to be honest. Do you reckon I could? Oh, no, here he comes. Here he comes. Oh, there's another one. Where did you come from? Oh, here they all come. Here they all come. That's one dead. Come on, you want some of this? Come on. Come at me, bro. Come at me. You really want some? I don't think they do. They're kind of scared. But I really want to get across there. I, oh, no. We shouldn't build down here. There's Spinos around. There's literally a Spino just right there. Mm, but I want to see what that thing is. It's moving. You see this thing right here? It's tiny. But it looks interesting. It's got my attention. Alright, we're gonna have to come back down here another time. We're not ready for the water just yet. I'm not ready to take on some piranhas. And I'm definitely not ready for either of those. That crab is just creepy looking. Alright, we gotta find somewhere else to go, I suppose. We gotta check something else out. There are these little charge bugs too. Glow bugs. I don't really know how they work just yet. We're gonna have to work them out at some point. Um, Alright, so here's the thing. We're not building near water. <laughs> water is danger from what I'm seeing. 
Water is definitely danger. So we're staying well away from that. I mean, maybe I can build something small here because this kind of looks like a little... <gasps> Silica Fells. Yo. Yeah, oh. Prana's around. No, we're good. We're good. Uh-huh. wonder if it can... Look at him. All right, I'm hungry. We gotta eat some. We gotta eat some. Uh, we gotta eat some berries. We don't have any meat cooked just yet, so we we'll smashed down a bunch of berries. Um, I'm getting very distracted. <laughs> getting very distracted. So today, all I really want to try and achieve is to set up a little bit of a safe, a little bit of a safe house. I don't know where that's gonna be, but uh, I guess we're just gonna have to. There's more crabs over there. Those crabs are so creepy looking. This crab just- No! No! I forgot about this! Oh dear god, no! Oh, I'm vomiting! <laughs> okay, okay, that's enough now. That's enough, I'm getting dizzy. I'm getting dizzy. Okay, so, there are a couple types of mushrooms in this world. The red ones, you want to avoid them. You want to avoid the red ones. They're kind of hallucinogenic. They kind of mess with your brain a little bit. I want to stay well away from those. We got scorpions now as well. Um, yeah. Bad news bears is what they, is what they bring on. Also, what is this? What's happened over here? A ravage is dead. Can I harvest it? Come on. Give me some, give me something. Give me some. I see a scorpion. He's coming straight at me. And what are you? An aberrant carno. An aberrant carno. Okay, I've got to harvest these. We can get some prime meat. We can get some regular meat. Okay, scorpions fighting the stego. Nice. Perfect timing. Just don't hit me. Just don't let me die in the crossfire. We got some hide. We got some pelt. Hide and pelt. That's what I like to see. Oh, no. Not again. Not again. Not again. Not again. No. <laughs> I didn't mean to do this. I didn't ask for this. Oh, God. I'm going to die soon. <gasps> I'm going to die right now. No. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Indeed. 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 Um, interesting. Oh, I shouldn't have come over this way. Check out this. There are spawn points around here, but they're all medium. They're all medium difficulty spawn points. Let's see how close we just spawned to where we died. I don't like our chances here, though. I don't like our chances one bit. Can I find my stuff? Oh, no, there's raptors here. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Okie dokie, then. Um, I don't see- oh, there is no way I'm getting through this. There is no way I'm getting out of here. I'm just gonna try and run along this giant boulder. Nope, stuck already. Maybe. I can't see anything. I am just gonna hope that I'm not running near raptors. Oh, it's right, right there, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die! Ah, <sighs> he didn't- he didn't see me. He didn't see me. That's what I like to see. Oh, thank you. Oh, there's another road right there. Okay. Where in the world did I die? Oh, the map's not going to tell me, is it? Of course not. All right, I'm just going to... Oh! Why does this look familiar? It does, though, doesn't it? It looks familiar, but I don't know if it looks familiar because I... I don't know. I don't think so. We might just need to get started from scratch again. We might need to just... We might... We might need to just start again. We might need to just start again. No! <laughs> I survived that? Okay. There is hope. There's my dead body. Oh, snap. Okay. We just gotta heal up. A tiny little bit. Is, is that an iguanodon right here? I've never tamed one of those. Where did that turtle just come from? Okay. I'm gonna eat. Uh, go. Looks invigorating. Sure. The auric mushroom. Smash him down. Why not? Why not? Is that gonna heal me a little bit? Because I gotta get to my stuff. I gotta get to my stuff. And we gotta keep an eye on these mushrooms. We can't be running through the red mushroom patches. We learned that the hard way. Alright, more mushrooms. More mushrooms. Get them into you, buddy. Get them into you. We're gonna survive. We're not dying again today. Even though we had another very, very close call. <gasps> My thirst! How am I so thirsty again? Come on. Lucky we got some water here. There we go. Get that water into you, buddy. Get that water into you. Nice. 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 There is hope for us yet. 
<laughs> oh my god, those crabs are scary looking. I understand why this is the medium spawn zone now. I don't think we're supposed to come over here. Yet. Alright. Our legs have healed. No more broken legs for this brute. Let's retrieve. Oh, I forgot about our boy. Oh no. I nearly forgot about you, buddy. I'm sorry. He must have been terrified. He must have been absolutely terrified. Alright, let's drop the rest of this junk that we're never, ever, 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 ever going to use. And we'll take all of our existing stuff that we are definitely, most definitely, definitely going to use. Alright. Fantastic. In fact, it's time to put... Where'd my hat go? Wait, what? Wait. I had a cloth hat, didn't I? Where'd my cloth hat just... Alright, I'm losing my mind. So I might have dropped it. I might have dropped... Did I drop my cloth hat? I swear I didn't. Can I just get my body? Cloth hat. There we go. Alright. Cloth hat. Check. Santa hat. Check. <laughs> Santa and all of his presents. Hell yeah. Look at me. Looking good. Alright. So... Oh. The carno and stuff that we were... That we were over here to harvest. They are no more. Or are they? Oh, the scorpion died. Oh! Free cutting, baby! That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. Hell yeah. Alright. Okay. Oh, red mushrooms. Okay, good. We kind of dodged them a little bit. Alright, let's get to the water. So the water is going to be vital to our survival this series. Um, and avoiding those crabs and spinos is also going to be very vital to this series. So avoid everything, basically. You know what? I think I found a nice spot for us. Oh my gosh. Water is not safety. Spino. Okay, spino. Over that way, I saw crocodiles. More spinos. See, I was thinking, if I can just get across this river, that would be nice. Please no piranhas. Please no piranhas. Didn't even think about a manta ray. Oh, we're going to die. We're going to die. No, we're not. Not today. Not today. Ho, 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 ho. Close call. Very, very close call. I don't like our chances, guys. <laughs> I don't like our chances at all. Are we going to survive? Are we going to live? I don't... I don't know. I don't know. I'm just going to build a little hut. That's all I'm going to do. I'm going to build a little tiny, little, little, itty, little bit of a little bit of a hut. If I can. Um, foundations. Let's get a thatch foundation first up. And I might just go straight to wood. Because I don't think our thatch is going to survive for very long out here. So, wood. We need more wood. We need more wood. Okay. Let's get two of these. We'll set up a bed. We'll set up a bed. And that's about it. Wait. I didn't get any wood for that? That's fungal wood. There we go. Okay. Two foundations. Check. We're going to need ourselves a bed. An S plus simple bed. What, what better of a bed to get? Okay. And at least once we get this stuff down, we will be able to respawn somewhat closer to where we died. Alrighty. So, I'm thinking... I'm thinking right up against this wall. What better of a spot to, to build? There we go. There we go. Fantastic. I'm going to need some... I'm going to need some walls. Which I don't have just yet. Uh, S plus one walls. Check. Uh, door frame. We're going to need a door frame. There we go. Alright. And that should at least... That should be a starting point. <laughs> I know how bad this looks. I know how stupid this looks. I know... Oh my god. There's a spider watching me build my house. There's a spider watching me build my house. Oh, I don't like this one bit. I don't like this one bit at all. Okay. Maybe this is bad. Maybe this is a bad idea. You know, I'm just going to go out on a limb and say... It's kind of a bad idea. <laughs> but it's okay. It's okay. This is our very first... Very first... Safe haven. I think I'm going to keep this foundation. We have a bed. At least we can respawn out here now. Um, and I'm going to smash some berries down. We're not going to cook any meat just yet either. Because we don't got time for that. Ain't nobody got time for that. And I'm going to see if we can maybe make it to maybe somewhere a tiny, insy, a little bit safer. Let's have a look at our map here, okay? I can barely see it because it's so dark. 
All right, we're gonna head up this way. Something's roaring behind me. Making me feel a little bit uncomfortable, but that's okay. It's literally just spinos and crabs the entire way along this river. Spinos and crabs for days. I don't know, oh, and, 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 and crocodiles! And sarcos! Just what I want to be seeing right now. And mantas. There's a couple mantas as well. <laughs> well, I'm going to avoid... The oh my god, there's a bloodbath over there right now. Let's ignore that. Alright, you know what? Let's get, our, let's get our weight up a little bit. And I think next I might crank some levels into movement speed. Just so we can evade things a little bit nicer. But things are looking... Oh... Hey, little dodo. Do I still have my boy? I still got my little, I still got my little bulb dog, my little girl chilling on my shoulder. That is worrying me though. That is worrying me though. I guess we're about to witness. Oh, it's just a dodo. We're about to witness the true strength. Who wins? The crab or the turtle? Oh yeah, the crab's winning that battle. I'm out of here. I'm out of here. <laughs> Stuff that. Stuff that. Staying well away from that. It isn't looking too bad. I say that right as I come across a raptor. And a spino. Oh no. No, oh, no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Leave me alone, please. Leave me alone, please. Come on. Come on, rabbit hole. Oh, and I can't take on another one. Not another one. No. No. <laughs> Okay. Alrighty then. Yeah, about that. I'm gonna to go for a random spawn. I'm gonna go for a random spawn. Let's have a. Are we? Oh, look at this. Perfect. I'm right next to where we died. Right next to where we died. I think. Nope. This is the original one. Nope. This is our first. This is our first death. This is the first time we died. It was the wrong death! That's alright. I'll let you guys I'll let you guys take me out, alright? I'll let you finish me, okay? I need to respawn. You may as well do the honors of, of, of helping me do that. I'm kinda of thinking of just spawning up near uh near the first high lake. The easiest. The first high lake, sorry. The easiest spawn point in the game, apparently. First high lake one. Let's just Ditch everything we've collected up until now and start fresh. This area looks much nicer. In fact, this is the area that this is the area that we were working with during our stream. Look at this! We got crystal over there. We got rocks. We got green stuff. We got dinosaurs. You know what? Yeah, this is where we're gonna build our house. <laughs> Stuff that other part. Stuff that other part. Nah, nah. We're not going back over there. We're gonna chill over here now. What is that? Look at that spino. That is a cool looking spino. I don't care what any of y'all say. Is that like a boss dino? Is that like a like a boss type of thing? Because I've never seen a spino. Awesome music, I love it. <laughs> I've never seen a spino look like that. That's awesome looking though. I love it. I think that is really, really cool. Um, let's get ourselves some thatch. And hopefully some wood. There's some fungal wood. Let's get ourselves some hide. And I guess we better get the bowl rolling yet again. Oh, check it out. Check it out. The uh, the old Spino over there. He ain't no cool colors anymore. That's, that must be like the nighttime feature. Another earthquake! <laughs> All right, I'll take it. I'll take it. Where's these free resources that pop out of the ground? Where's my free resources? I heard him. There we go. <gasps> Ooh, green gem. Hey there. Ooh, some obsidian. Ooh, some crystal. That's what I'm talking about. Some stone, some, oh my god, there's so much popping out of the ground right here. Ha! Oh, what a jackpot! I love the earthquakes! The earthquakes are the best thing in the world. Okay, can I get myself a bed yet? No, we need hide. I just, oh, look, he's glowing again! <laughs> Alright, I was wrong. He is still glowing. I, no, is he? Or is he? Nope, he's not glowing. It must be the water. The water must be magic. The water must make him glow. That's all I can put this down to. I, I don't know what else could be making that happen. Yeah, look. He's entering the water. And he's glowing. That must be what it is. Alright, either way. Either way. 
Let's get ourselves a couple more foundations. Get that house that we've been looking for. There? That looks so cool. I don't care what anybody says. I think we need a little bit of gamma. The game is the game is quite dark at night time. I'll tell you what. I think this level here we're going to throw you onto movement speed. Because we are super duper slow right now. We need all the speed we can get. Let's be real. I don't know why I'm collecting stone. really don't have any purpose for it right now. In fact, what level am I? Like 10 or something? Can I get myself a spyglass? I can. At level 7. Do I have the resources to craft one though? No! Hide. Hide is like the one thing that I'm missing to do anything right now. Hmm. Are there any easy kills around? There is a little bulb dog. I really don't want to kill him though. Look how cute he is. And I do need another companion. I can't kill him. I, c I can't. I just can't do that. I've got to tame him. We've got to tame him. I, I, I can't. I don't have it in me to kill a little baby bulb dog. But is there anything else around? Anything? I can't see a thing. It must be night time. Is there anything around that can give us a... Oh, hey, buddy. Can I get myself a spear? What am I missing for a spear? I haven't learnt it yet. Okay. Let's get ourselves a spear. All right. I'm going to keep on feeding you. This Parasaur may be our answer. He may be the answer to our, our hide problems. I'm just going to have to corner him somehow. I'm just going to have to corner him. Which we'll do, don't you worry. As soon as I get my Bulb Dog. Yeah! Our second Bulb Dog. He needs a name! Let me know down below. <laughs> Alright, you get in that corner. You run away from me. Pick your... Pick your... No, 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 no. Not this way. Not this way. You're running the wrong way! Come back! Not that way. No, 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 no. There's Spinos over there. Please. Oh, man. I can't keep up. I can't keep up with them. Darn it. I am going to go ahead, though, get myself a campfire, and we're going to, I guess... Oh, do I, I didn't even have meat, do I? No, we don't, because we lost it all. We lost every little, itsy little bit of it. Oh, I just reminded myself about something. So, there's a lot of new recipes, and one of those is a glow stick. Which I think we have the resources to actually craft for ourselves. <gasps> An Ovis! An Ovis! Otis! I'm not taming this Otis though. I hope you guys know that right. There's other things I need right now. One of those is this. No, I didn't want to throw that, but we did anyway. Fine, it is what it is. Ovis. Otis the Ovis. I need, I need whatever you've got for me. I need some meat. I just need anything right now. I'm sorry for this. Height. Yes. I was worried it was going to give me fur and pelt. Ooh, hide and pelt. And mutton. Ooh. Ooh. Look at all of this. 200 pelt just about. I'm just going to stand here all day harvesting poor little lotus. It just never ends. He's the gift that keeps on giving. <laughs> you ever going to stop? It's getting a little bit excessive. I can't actually move anymore. My weight is like through the roof. Maybe this is where I build my little house. I'm going to make sure I don't hit that for a start. Um, maybe this is where I build a little temporary house. Right here. Like that. <laughs> Why not? Why not? Um, let me just let me go put a wall over there. Let me build my... Can I put a... Can I, all right, fine. Campfire, campfire sits down here. No, I wanted to throw my meat into it. All right, I'm going to need some storage like a sap. A sappy. All right, mutton, check. Mm, wood, one piece of wood, check. Um, okay, let me go and drop our fur. Because I need to get us a, I need to get us a box. Got to get us some storage. Box. Storage box. Can I get a big one straight away? We might be able to. We might be able to. Let's just get some wood for now. We get some wood. We'll get our storage. I'll throw everything into there. And then at least we've got a house that looks remotely safe. Near water, without any crabs around. Yippee. Yeah. Oh, I guess... I guess I need some more wood in here, don't I? <laughs> I guess I need some more wood. Can you even cook this stuff? You can. It's just really, really slow. Oh, no. I picked this up and I can't... Move. Okay. Alright. But you go in there. Crystal goes in there. Obsidian goes in there. The green gem stuff goes in there. Can I get a bed? What am I missing for a bed? Uh, fiber. 
little bit of, okay. I'll throw my skins in there. Hide some mushrooms. Why not? And the stone, of course. We don't need that. All right, I think we've got everything that we need to get our thing Bobby on the way. We have ourselves a bed. And I'll, I think I think we're in a pretty safe position right now. I think I think safety is some is probably the one thing we kind of I feel safe at least. I should probably get some walls up to be honest, but I'm feeling pretty good about this. And I think this is a great point to end episode one. Thanks so much for watching, guys. I really hope you enjoyed this. If you did, make sure to go ahead, punch the thumbs up, make it rain those thumbs ups, and make sure to let me know if you're excited for this aberration series. It's gonna be. I, I got a good feeling about it. I think it's going to be one of the better series lately. Even though we've had some pretty crazy modded series. But that is all for this one. I'll catch you guys in the next one very, very soon. Bye. Bye now.